Hi, I'm Jay Maya, and I am the youngest international pun championships award winner in history. Yes, puns. I guess you can call me a pundit. I wanted to prove that, you know, young nerdy girls are good at puns too. It's not just dads, guys. My favorite method of sewing is the Ernest Hemming way. <laughs> a friend's funeral didn't go right the first time, so we had to do it again. It was a rehearsal. There was a topic I really loved was the topic of hair. I was against a really well-known competitor and I remember I felt quite stranded, you know, up all alone on the stage. <laughs> the style that I competed in was a form of spontaneous punning. So the idea is they would give you a topic and the topics would be weird and niche and you would have five seconds to come up with a pun on the subject. It was an absolute shock that I ended up winning the most valuable punner award. It did actually make me the youngest international pun championships award winner in history, which is honestly something that just blows my mind. So something that I would actually do to prepare for pun competitions is, however silly it sounds, read the dictionary and read synonym lists and just try to expand my vocabulary on all subjects. Probably would make for the least exciting training montage of all time, but <laughs> that's what it is. You may ask yourself, hmm, what does someone do with that? Which is a very good question that I've had to explain to a lot of family members. And the answer for me is you become a recording artist who writes really nerdy songs. This song is about a boy that I had a crush on who also really liked doing crossword puzzle. Really? <laughs> this chorus is actually a crossword puzzle, is it? What's a Generally, my vision for, for the music that I make is to make fellow nerds feel at home and to feel like it's cool to be into these really nerdy things. I'm passionate about building representation for other Indian Americans growing up as well to say, you know, you can be anything you want. You can be a nerd and you can be cool. Those things are not mutually exclusive.